Why black men, it, white women are looked at as success. Because yes. in, in America, we see a white woman, I couldn't have you. My daddy mm -hmm. couldn't have you. My granddaddy couldn't have you. Mm -hmm. I would get killed even looking at mm -hmm. you. People, if they thought I whistled at you, they would murder me, mm -hmm. beat me, mm -hmm. drag me down the street. Mm -hmm. So now, if I play for the NBA, I want them all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you this. And I can afford them all. That's, yeah. what, that's what they're thinking. And the sad thing is that has to do with the slave master mentality. It does. But we're, at, but we're we're superseding it. No, no, no. Yeah, nah. I, it's, 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 I was just <laughs> slave for this long. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to take your woman. And because mm -hmm. your woman always wanted me. Mm -hmm. She all she mm -hmm. always dreamt about oh, she me. She had you she, in the yeah, barn. Yeah, but that's what I think. Because she it was, snuck and had you Because anyway. it was forbidden. Mm-hmm. It was forbidden, so therefore, mm -hmm. now that it doesn't have to be forbidden, mm -hmm. I'm gonna show that I'm the superior being, mm -hmm. and I'm, I'm the, the dominant original man, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna act within that. Mm -hmm. So therefore, that's why I believe at times we like, yo, once you get money, once you get success, once you get, mm -hmm. I'm not following anyone else's rules, I'm gonna love who I wanna love. And the interestingly, interesting part about that is, we don't wanna sit here and say, well, the black woman was raped, she was murdered, she was lynched, she was dismembered, she did all these things. My child, I couldn't look at my child or sell them to another plantation. They tarred and feathered me if my woman showed any love to me. And to this day, the to black this... woman is still the most mistreated Absolutely. person right. on the planet. Exactly. And you're telling me, we went through all these different things. By the way, the white woman was largely part of that. Right. Uh, literally. She would help to rape the black man. She would help to buck break us. She would help to sell uh, those of us into other plantations, etc. So you're telling me... The black woman who has been there for us the whole damn time. Right. Who was there when us when we were getting lynched, who was there for us when we were getting whipped every day, who was there for us to heal our wounds, to give us consolation of mind, to bring us peace and quiet of mind, to help us to get through another day. Right. You telling me she doesn't deserve at least, and I'm not saying after the brothers, y'all like, man, I tried. Hold on, listen, listen, you didn't try enough, goddamn. <laughs> right. Just like, hold on, brother, come on. If it's if you can give up on a black woman so easily, you don't deserve no other woman because you have demonstrated that you can't give enough love to the number one who needs it the most mm. because she has been destroyed the most, mm. she has been rejected the most. She is the number one, number one divorced, last married, most mistreated, and you telling me Facts. that because now you have money. Mm. Now I'm free to go mess with the same white woman who helped to keep me in slavery. Same white woman who helped to remove the black woman from the home because she needed numbers to help to get rights from her white man when we were together as a black family to fight for civilian rights. Okay. You telling me you got some goddamn money mm -hmm. and you just going to go give it not to the black woman who has been there for you, who you have invested in and she has invested in you, mm -hmm. but give it to somebody who has no connection to your own damn race, your ethnicity whatsoever. Because when you are marrying, when you are coming together, you are coming together with the culture, mm -hmm. with the people. But now we're talking about too many selfish black brothers, mm -hmm. selfish who want to come together with a white one as an individual as though she is the epitome of greatness. She's the most beautiful. She has the best hair. She has the best everything. No, I think I take some brown sugar over some white cancer causing sugar any day. I can't have both. <laughs> like, you can't have, can have both. That's, that's up to you. I'm selfish. You called it out. And yeah, that's up I to you. It all. It's ignorant. And that and is in, up in to that you. Sense, only, and, and that's you, why choice I come, is I come from a very comedic place with, with this, but in, in all seriousness, mm -hmm. All of those statements that you make, as accurate as they are, mm -hmm. when when defining love, mm -hmm. there should be no boundaries. Well, what is love? 